tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Radio. The views and opinions expressed in the following program are those of the program anchors and producers and do not necessarily reflect the policies and position of this station. We now bring you the program that brings together leading personalities, representative insights, all together in a meaningful and delightful conversation as your social barometer. Let's chat with Tita Gracie. Let's chat with Tita Gracie. Hosted by Breakthrough Millennial Boomer, Gracie Venezuela, only here on V81 Radio. Sometimes some people also refer to music as the healing, the ultimate medicine for our hearts and minds, especially with the stress and all the problems going on in the world. Tonight, we're going to have some guests, all with their distinct experiences and musical journeys in the world of music. And I'd like to introduce our first guest. He's no stranger to the screen because he is a musical director of uh, a famous uh, uh, channel uh, on cable and he's going to be joined by two of his lovely daughters and this is none other than Mr. Ernie Magtoto to be joined by Carmela Navarro and Katrina Mangahas. Hi! Hi! Hello. Hi! Hi, Tita Hi. Hi. Good evening! Welcome to Let's Chat with Tita Gracie, Ernie and Kat. Hi, and, uh, yes, good evening Grace and good evening to all the uh, televiewers of uh, your very wonderful show and uh, I'm sure there's a lot of followers already. Uh, talagang natulungan ng musika to cope with the isolation, with the lockdown at um, kung walang musika, hindi ko alam kung makakasurvive tayo nitong lockdown. Yes, yes, totoo po yun at ating Gracie. Ang sa akin po yung pangyayari na to, na, binalikan ko naman yung mga, kasi pag working musician ka, um, ang dami mong planong gawin sa sarili na hindi mo nagagawa kasi inuuna mo yung responsibilidad mo bilang yung trabaho ng, ng music. May mga gusto kang gawin na hindi mo magawa, sabi mo, saka na lang yan, saka na lang yan. Ngayon ko lang nagagawa yung mga gusto kong gawin, nakakatawa rin kahit pa paano. Alam natin hindi maganda yung pangyayari, pero we, we have to look at a, at a brighter side of it instead of, you know... Yun. Sabi nga nila, uh, hindi mo makukotwain ang creative spirit. <laughs> Totoo po yun. At mas, mas sumisikip, mas, mas kumakatas yan. Para napipiga lalo kapag, <laughs> kapag wala nang ginagawa. Oo, sa totoo lang. Talagang uh, because of uh, tonight, uh, sabi ko nga, anong magandang title ngayong gabi? Naisip ko yung title ng isang kanta na gustong gusto kong back in the 90s na ito. Yung Groove is in the Heart. Groove is in the Heart! <laughs> Totoo, di ba? Dami yung title ng kanta nga, di ba? Dance tune yan. Pero ito na, yun na appropriate kasi kayong mga top musicians and musical artists na nandito ngayon, your groove is really in your heart. At nakita sa mga buhay nyo, sa career, nakita ko sa stage, uh, si Pete at si Mike, nakatrabaho ko na rin. Kami nila Ernie, pag nag-get together yung pamilya namin, talagang hindi maaring walang tugtugan. Di ba, Ernie? <laughs> yes. Anyway, so um, ngayon, uh, we're going to go closer into our interview. And uh, I want to... Uh, Pete and Mike, babalikan mo kayo later. No, don't go away. I will just uh, proceed with our first interview and performance for the evening. Five hundred twenty-five thousand. 
I'm so honored that such a beautiful rendition. Favorite ko pa naman yan, Seasons of Love. Thank you for that beautiful rendition. That's all you, Ate Grey. <laughs> Talagang, ladies and gentlemen, we have just been treated to a beautiful rendition of Seasons of Love by my loved ones. Mahal, mahal na mahal ko itong mga to. No? Si Ernie Magtoto and ang kanyang mga anak na si Carmela Navarro at si Catherine Mangahas. Don't go away. We have more to come on Let's Chat with Tita Gracie here on V81 Radio Worldwide. Come back after this short break. We'll be back shortly with Tita Gracie. Let's Chat with Tita Gracie only here on V81 Radio. Big Benta, a Pinoy e-commerce site made for you. Enjoy hassle-free shopping with multiple payment options available. May local support then ready to assist so you can enjoy peace of mind when you shop. Visit our website to check different product offerings. Get anything you want and avail everything you need in just one click. Big Benda, Pinoy e-commerce made for you. After this pandemic, let's support the Filipino community. Buy local. Visit local. Go local. May items ka na gustong ibenta or planning to buy something specific? Visit PinoyAds.ph, a free online classified ads na available to all. Post well, uh, okay lang, good and bad, you know. Bad because wala na masyadong gigs, di ba? Oo nga. Yung tinutugtugan ko, okay? Alam, 
you know, bad kasi hindi na ako nakakapag-social uh, sa mga usual uh, people that I get along, I mean, like a be, uh, being with, you know, sa mga bars. Yes. Well, good in a way that you have time, the time kasi sa art mo, sa music mo to develop and to to see more grounds, you know, para mag-grow ka pa, you know. Kasi kulang ang lifetime para talaga ma, hindi naman ma-perfect but to really get what you want and then be able to to share it, you know. Sa yes. Art. And alam ko yung mga yung mga nagsusubaybay sa iyo, they follow you wherever you play. I know because I was one of your fans <laughs> and I still am. Uh, medyo naputo lang kasi there was a time na hindi, medyo I was uh, not able to go out anymore. Pero prior to that, talagang kung saan nagigig si Pete Canson, pupunta at pupunta talaga ako. Kasi uh, sax is my favorite jazz uh, uh, instrument. And uh, talagang nung nagkakilala tayo many years ago, uh, if I remember correctly, dun pa sa bar ni Freddy Aguilar, di ba? Yeah, yeah. Uh, ng dati sa bar ni, ni Ka Freddy and talagang walang pipigil sa akin rain or you know may bagyo or what pumupunta talaga ako doon para makinig ka yeah salamat Gracie salamat layo no no anyway <laughs> yeah uh, ganun katagal ka ba oo ganun katagal ka ba nag uh, play with the band of Ka Freddy wow well, mga more or less 20 years you know Oh. So you saw Freddy Aguilar talaga from way back and you you were with him throughout his career almost his entire career pala. Almost naman yung uh, uh, some songs when it was speaking you know I was with him already. And then uh, we were able to do three albums you know impromptu albums you know that. Pero syempre hindi na masyadong commercial because medyo naging jazzy jazzy yung band. <laughs> Father ko they just want me to play music, you know, so so yeah, maging arkitekto, so ginawa ko rin yun. But eventually, I have to tell him that, you know, I have to stop doing architecture and I have to play music. Kasi, yung talaga yung love ko, eh, you know. Okay. Oo, oh, yun nga, eh. Uh, yung, mga, yung mga parents kasi nung araw, syempre, they, the last thing they will think of is, o oh, maging mus- maging musikero ka or maging musical artist ang una nilang sasabihin oh magtapos ka ng uh, kurso na business yeah. or architecture or medicine or law pero talagang yeah. when your groove is in the heart you have to follow it di ba Pete? Yeah, yeah. in fact hindi nila alam habang nag-aaral ako tumutugtog ako eh kaya five year course yung architecture siguro nakuha ko na six and a half <laughs> <laughs> Kasi I'm trying, hindi niya alam. So last year, nag-aaral ko from, from uh, say, the Dave Clark file and all that. You know, sila, Gary Lewis and the Playboy and then rock and roll. Yes. So, drums, guitar, you know. And then finally, uh, I really subdued to saxophone because, you know, I, I think that's where my heart really uh, uh, want to stay, you know. <laughs> drummers will find a way to one day you know, they'll be really good and, and polished musicians, that's all. With yes. Guys, you know, I grew up in a community yeah. where people, I mean, musicians, co-musicians, don't really help musicians. They, they, yes. they uh, I don't know what kind of competition. You can feel the joy, no? Yeah. You can feel the joy when they perform with Pete Canson on stage. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, uh, uh, they're like my children. I, I love that, you know. I mean, people who want to jump, they, you know, that, that's no problem. They can always jump with me, you know. Yeah. Stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on V81 Radio, Manila.